What's up guys? Thanks for tuning in for another episode of Fish in the 509. How are you guys doing? Um, got a lot to say and I'm gonna try to keep it as short as possible. First things first, and I wrote everything down on my phone. Um, the video you're about to watch after this is a video of me that's been in the making for weeks and weeks. And it's not necessarily that I wanted it to last weeks and weeks, but I've just had a fishing slump. And so, yeah, it's been pretty cruddy fishing for me. I haven't had opportunities to really go out. Um, and so the times that I did go out, I just was not catching any fish. There was probably four, five, six, seven, 39 times that I went out and did not catch any fish. And so I have no footage to post if, uh, if I don't catch fish. And so that's been pretty difficult. Um, in the video you're gonna watch, I finally managed to go out and have a solid outing and catch some fish. And so um, before we get to that video, um, I just wanted to say thank you to all the people that have been supporting the channel. Um, we've reached a milestone, which I think was pretty cool, and, and I couldn't wait until I reached this milestone, and that was reaching 509 subscribers, and uh, that's just so cool. Um, you know, fishing the 509, you know, the area we live in is the 509, and so I just think that's something that's a little special to me, and it's something that I really wanted to, to reach. So thank you guys, I literally cannot do it without you. And so I truly love making the videos and the footage and the content for you know viewers and subscribers like yourselves. And so um, this video right now is my trip that I just had earlier this week and we're in the first week of November. So uh, check that out guys and thanks for watching. All right man, I know there's some rocks out here going this little, uh, little nasty Ned. See if he can't produce. Snag. This wind's putting a beating on us. Got one. Dude, I think a nice one. Oh, it's a pretty solid one. Dude, it's uh, like a one pounder, two pounder maybe. Come here, buddy. No, he's alive. Yeah. Oh yeah, on the Ned. Woo. Dude, I felt so good. Oh my, the camera's dead too. That one's dead. So I just had this chesty on, but oh my goodness. Finally. I've been chasing one of these dudes for weeks. Oh my goodness, feels so good. He's not a giant, but oh man, he's giant to me. Feels so good. All right, buddy, I'm gonna let you go. Thank you. You have ended my streak of depression. He is cold. Let's get this guy. See you, buddy. Don't get banged up on the rocks, man. Dude, that's a solid fish from the bank, dude. I should change this battery. Finally, after what seems like 10 trips, I finally got one. So let's hope this is an upward trend from here. We're gonna take another cast and see if we can't find another one. Dang, on this medium action rod, he felt like a five pounder. Another one. Yeah, another solid fish. Woo Nasty there. Nasty there. Coming in clutch. Yeah, a little smaller than the last one, but I'll take it. Woo yeah. Check them out, dude. Another one on the little nasty Ned. A little smaller, but man, it feels good, dude. That feels so good. Two fish in the first 15 minutes. That's been unheard of these days. Oh, look at this guy. Look at this beautiful fish right here, dude. Woo! 
Let's get him back. Let's get him back. See you later, buddy. There he goes. Peace out. Woo! I'm Jack now, dude. Snagged. I'm gonna do a mission right now. <clears throat> Wet foot. I don't know. Oh, I got it out. At the price of a wet shoe. Caught a couple fish here, but the trip's not over. We have about four or five spots we're gonna drop into um, and check it out. See, I'm wearing the 509, fishing the 509 t-shirt. Everyone's been asking about them, so. No, I'm just kidding. No one's been asking about them, but my mom and my dog. But either way, I do have these shirts now. If you're interested in them, hit me up. Um, but we'll talk about those later. Let's go catch some fish. Just walking, man. I'm gonna jump the guardrail make my way down there. Let's check it out. Water's pretty stained over here. Chance to touch the bottom. Let's get out of here, man. Too windy. Too, too windy here. Oh, we got two more spots to check out. You need a towel, dude? We'll say about 45 minutes here, one hour at the buoys, and then, yeah, and then one hour at the buoys, and that's it, man. Just like stairs, man. All right, man. Let's get a fish. Just a five pounder hiding in here. Imagine. Oh, dude, I got one. Yeah. On the nasty. It's a, it's a, what? It's a trout. Oh, he came off. I've seen some huge bass hiding in these corners before. There it is. Yeah. So, did you get a bath? A little bath. It's on a tube, dude. Yeah, dude. I don't even care if this dude's dinky, man. This dude is, yes, thank you, dude. Dude, that's so crazy. Oh, I'm gonna let you go. All right, man. Woo! There he goes. Sweet, dude. He choked this tube, dude. It was literally down in his intestines already. Beginning the digestion process. <laughs> yep, I think I have another hit right now. There's another one. On tubular. Dude, just dragging it. Think about the, uh, I'm letting it drop for like 10 seconds. Same size as the last guy, but I'll take them. Maybe a little bit bigger. Right. Another one. And I'm actually casting like at these big pillars, like just at the, and then just let them sink. Yes, another one, dude. So, so happy. See ya, buddy. Whoa! This guy's crazy, dude. Dang it, man. We only got about an hour of light left. I'm gonna move to that point. Try it out. See what's along this. Got one. 
Got one. Got one. I think it's a nice one, man. Oh, a nice smallie. Like a two pound small jaw. Maybe bigger. That's a beautiful fish, man. Woo! On tubular. Come on, don't, don't break off, oh, come on. No, nah, maybe like a one. My luck has finally changed. Got a beautiful smallie. Oh man, feels good, dude. Feels good. Let's get this guy back in where he belongs. Boom. It's been a rough, rough couple of weeks. So everything I'm catching right now is just amazing. Oh man, caught him off this point right here where this current's coming in. My heart, dude. Ready to move? Yep, finally. I got 30 minutes or less at this next spot. Sucks. These are some not good conditions right now. Man, there's just so much wind I can't even feel what's down here. Woo, let's get out of here, man. It's way too cold. Whoa, oh, I almost fell. All right, guys, and last but not least, just to wrap everything up, for the giveaway, I'll be giving away five Fish in the 509 t-shirts. To enter, all you gotta do is be a subscriber, like this video, and drop that comment that you are done down in the description below. Once you are done with that, then you've been entered the contest. I'll use a random generator, randomly select five people, and uh, that's pretty much it. Um, follow one of my social media accounts to get a hold of me if you win, or if you would like to buy a t-shirt. Once again, those links will be down in the description. Good luck, and I'll see you guys in the next vid. Oh, and another thing, a couple of my students wanted me to show off some of their artwork in here. We got this one right here from Derek. Here's a picture of me catching jaws. Um, another fish in the 509 one right here, a couple fish in the 509. Um, just some of the fan art from my subscribers, aka my students. Um, pretty dope. Once again, guys, thanks again for this art.